I think sometimes, you know, I think people get too wrapped up in, you know, the, the minutia of beer and, like, just forget to enjoy it. We're just here to produce good beer that people can come and enjoy in a friendly atmosphere and, you know, have a few different offerings. I mean, I enjoy the pinballs. I mean, I've been, you know, we've been collecting them forever. And so it's like, it's nice to be able to throw out a collection. I like mechanical things. I mean, like, they're, I mean, it's like I told other people, it's like a Rube Goldberg machine, but it actually works, you know. You, can, you know, like, when he hit the, the guy and he falls down, it's, it's just, you know, it's kind of fun, you know. You know, we want it to be easy to come in and enjoy beer, not, not like a chore, you know. So, Um, I think if you, if you name anything an IPA, it's going to sell. I mean, I think we sell the most of our seven-star IPA. Uh, but we've been, like, kind of playing around with these New England style, which is kind of, kind of that hazy, soft, juicy IPA. And those seem to be, you know, we can pick it up really, you know, pretty quickly. Uh, we had a line, an hour, hour and 45 minute line. All of Friday, and, and I was surprised that people were waiting. I mean, I'm really glad. It's like it, it, it like made my heart grow just to see. Like, I'm like Jesus, I'm looking like, man, we we came here and like this was an industrial wasteland. I mean, there was these big semi trucks parked over here, like this like illegal paint shop, chop shop garage down over there. And, and uh, guys fixing big rigs over here. It was just crazy. And like now we've gotten it all cleaned up. And I, you know, looked at it from you know two uh, two years ago from what it is then to what it is now. It's, 